Well, here's a piece of news that I was not expecting to drop the way they did. I expected this, but not how, one, it was portrayed, and two, basically also how, uh, what else was coming after it. If you guys don't, uh, if you guys haven't been on Twitter lately, Shield Hero has indeed been announced for a second season, which is something a lot of us had predicted, seeing how big it was on both the West Coast. And the, basically, the West of the world actually really ate up shield hero as a whole i know a lot of people who enjoyed it i had my qualms with the series but i felt like overall it was an enjoyable show and something that i could easily just watch with and i also watched it with my roommate so that was also a really cool experience uh because m me and my roommate don't really watch a lot of shit together and being able to sit down and watch a show both as an from an anime uh was an fun experience and the fact that he enjoyed shield hero and i was already caught up with shield hero because he only watched it dubbed uh it was a pretty fun little experience so that's one of my fondest memories with this show along with some other major things that happened throughout the story but yeah we all a lot of us expected a season two announcement around the corner based on the success and the popularity of the show both in japan and in other parts of the world especially like I said, in the West. But then, another bombshell happened. So, this was announced at Crunchyroll Expo today on the 1st of September. And I did not expect to get it immediately right after the Season 2 announcement to get a Season 3 announcement right on top of it. And both are apparently in production. So, this leads me to believe that Season 2 is probably going to be coming out relatively soon. The fact that they're or they, they have confirmed it, unless they might be just saying this, but the fact that they said that Season 3 is in production, they're probably on or near the finishing touches of Season 2. Uh, so, like, probably maybe some editing, some, they probably have most of the voice acting maybe done, or at least, at the very least, they have the complete script written, and they basically just need it at a finish some animation and maybe some dubbing on uh, the Japanese side and who knows like we might be getting a season 2 announcement release date relatively soon the fact that we get a season 3 announcement uh, is probably is the main indicator but i am actually excited because i feel like shield hero one it left off on on just an open note there's so much that can happen with the world uh there is a lot of things the the, the story is by by no means wrapped up anyway whatsoever without getting into anything with if people who have not seen the actual show yet or finished it so yeah, we needed a second season, and I knew we were going to get a second season eventually. I just thought it was going to be at least a little bit down the line. Uh, but, yeah, in fact, I didn't think that at Crunchyroll Expo, of all things, we were actually going to get the announcement. I don't think uh, it was announced anywhere else. I think this was the first announcement, but, yeah, I'm really surprised at what they did. I know people are like, oh, hey, by the way, Shield Hero uh, panel. I'm like, okay, that's, that's a little bit interesting. I wonder why that there's your shield hero panel um i know that when i went to anime expo we had a promise neverland and even at the promise neverland uh panel there wasn't anything really announced besides the fact that we got the japanese seiyus and the english voice actresses all together in one room and made this really cool sketch where it was in both dubs of the japanese dub and then the english dub but they didn't really talk about anything they just said that yes a season two was an announcement and that was it they did it they I, I don't even remember if they even said it was in production um like currently in production they, it probably was um just that it was basically happening so yeah it probably was in production but they didn't really go into any details so i felt like it might have been the same thing where they might have just gotten some of the seiyus or um other voice actors together and just talk about it do a q and a maybe just talk about like how fun it was to work on shield hero i did not expect an announcement at that panel at all and it said it, I, I i actually wish i want to see if there was an actual video I, it, i'm pretty sure it'll pop up eventually um if there if it was done but if there was an actual video at the panel where they dropped the announcement because that's a fan <laughs> that would be patchly really cool i would have been like oh second season that's awesome oh wait a second season three what the damn hell <laughs> yeah but in all honesty i'm really excited because i feel like i said Season 1 was an enjoyable show. It wasn't the best 
show by far. As not even close to that season. Well, granted, the, the seasons that we're in, there were better shows on both sides, in my opinion. But the show was enjoyable. Had its qualms. I personally had a, my own qualms with it, but it was still a, it was still an enjoyable show, fun to watch. And the fact that we're getting more of it is actually really good. And I feel like I ho I really hope that they will expand upon some things that I had some qualms with, and maybe, who knows, maybe this will be a very, very, very good show in the end. I know a lot of people think it's already already a really good show, but the critique in me, me personally, my own opinion, uh, I felt like it could have been done better, but who knows, maybe things will get better with these next coming uh, seasons. But yeah, what are, you guys, what are your guys' thoughts on the whole fact that we're going to get two more seasons of the rise of the shield here i wonder if it's going to be two cores like it was with the first one if i believe each core usually usually translates to about 12 to 13 episodes per per core so for example right now fire force which is currently airing has been guaranteed for four cores so i believe 48 episodes at, at minimum but it could uh, that usually fluctuates sometimes i could do 52 episodes like maybe how soul leader did um but who knows maybe if we do get two cores per season that's actually gonna be a lot that's a lot of shield hero and I'm, I'm looking forward to it and as per usual I most likely will be reacting to it because I reacted to the first season but yeah what are your guys's expectations from the rise of the shield hero and for the manga viewers or the light novel viewers what were your what are your thoughts what are your are, are you happy are you like a little bit worried maybe they butchered some things in the light in the in the anime adaptation um, do you think that's going to be the same in the, uh, with this current adaptation with these next couple seasons being announced? But, are you guys interested? Are you guys, do you guys even care that this show is getting two more seasons? But let me know in the, what you guys think in the comment section below. But yeah, again, Crunchyroll Expo did not expect to get a giant, giant, giant drop from this uh, but i guess crunchyroll expo is a huge event i haven't been to it so and i probably won't be, ever be able to go to it because if i go to anime expo i can't go to crunchyroll expo it's just too conflicting with my current work schedule the fact that i even got the, the fact that i was even able to go to anime expo this year was hard enough already and the fact that and you know it's less than a month in between uh no it's about a month in between i believe if i no no it's a little bit over a month in between that's still too much for me it's already hard enough to get time off and then to schedule uh, just X amount of time away from work and home and then just trying to find all that stuff. It's already hard enough. So probably won't ever be able to go to Crunchyroll Expo for the foreseeable future unless something happens drastically. But what else are you looking forward to? Who knows? Maybe there's going to be more announcements. I don't know if uh, Crunchyroll Expo ends anytime soon. I have no idea. But yeah, I'm legitimately interested on seeing how this is going to fold out. But yeah, expect a release date relatively soon. They have to be... This is probably in production for quite a long time. The fact that one, it was announced, and the fact that it was already in production, it had to have already been in production for at least a good amount of time for them to announce a season three. Um, and considering that they... Uh, I believe they said it's both in development, if I am looking for it correctly and can't find the actual tweet that I saw. I just, I'm just looking that... I just see the tweet that it's confirmed, but yeah. Really interested in seeing what's going to happen. What are your guys' thoughts? And uh, thank you guys so much for stopping by for this news wrap-up, I guess. Didn't think I was going to be making a video today, but this thoroughly surprised me. In a good way. More Shield Hero? I'm down. Perfectly down. Alright guys, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time. See ya.